okay guys unfortunately for me it is time to get rid of this whole setup i am going to do my halloween table and the halloween table is going to be the exact same thing it was last year i think i just might leave out these gray mats and probably i don't know but we'll see how we're gonna do it we probably remiss it a little bit but yeah we are finna get to the Halloween table, so enjoy the footage, you guys. Got me tied down on the way to the beach. Four bad chicks in the middle of the street. Oh, right up in the yard. Okay, this is the same setup as last year, like I told you guys. But this was only on my table for a couple of weeks. Like, literally one week. So I had to bring it back. And I got another one of these trays also. So, yeah. The only thing that I think that I may do different is get skeleton heads for salt and pepper shakers, but I couldn't find any that was gold. I found some silver, I found some Mexican themed ones, but I couldn't find nothing that was gold or black. Well, the Mexican thing did have a black one in there, a black one. But it then it had a black and white, and then they had decorative faces. But yeah, so we're gonna go back with the original salt and pepper shakers that was on the table. And I'm not finished setting up the table yet. But yes, I will let you see an overview of this table once I get done, you guys. So yeah, let's get finished. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, this is the whole place setting from uh, the fall decorations. And I'll just take that whole thing up. Like, just take the whole thing up. Put it in my plate now. I should have had this out. Put in my plate for hand down. Okay. Take away this. pepper shakers there and that is that one bag so I could put that stuff up. So this is the table. I still haven't found out what I'm gonna do for my centerpiece yet. So yeah. Let's think about that. But this is the table so far when I find out or idea, you know, go through the stuff that I have to see what I can do to make a pretty centerpiece. Then we'll be on and popping. Okay, guys, so I'm 
Okay, so we're gonna take the flowers out of here just so we could just have kind of sort of the same setup. We're gonna put Mr. Skeleton here. <laughs> Look how he's leaning. And we're gonna put the heads here. I was last year stuff. I think he is like super creepy. That one. And then we're gonna put one like that. But we're gonna put the skeleton like right there. Make him hold himself up. And then we'll just repeat the same thing here. Which I put him like that. And Is my uh, this what is pumpkin got at? You remember the um, pretty, pretty okay? Excuse me, let me get my phone, I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, you guys know that I am always updating something, so I just took the little cotton and put it in there, made it look like. The head was bubbling. So, yeah. So, now back to your regular scheduler program. Okay, we was talking about this pumpkin. I'm going to take it off for this guy that I got last year. This faux marble pumpkin. I mean, this faux marble skeleton head <laughs> okay so we just taking the pure one pumpkin over there and we're going to put the skeleton head here or maybe I'll give him height and put my own marble tray back in the middle just to make it look like cute so yeah that's about it for this table but hold on let me try another thing before we go try to make this head have height okay do you remember this tray was on the table last year so we just went and got it from the kitchen and we're gonna put him back on here and uh oh i don't know i think i'm gonna have to take this off of here off of the top of there Top of the two tier tray, and maybe we just let him sit up here, like like so. Okay, I think that is gorgeous. As long as nobody don't come over here and mess with it. <laughs> okay, well.
Hello on the table, you guys. I'll give you a tour of the table. I hope you enjoyed it. Yeah, I don't have the uh, Halloween runner this year. But I think it's fabulous. And the runner just might show up somewhere else. So be on the lookout for that. So yeah, my table and my dining room table. I mean, my dining room table and my coffee table is the only thing that uh, don't got decorated so far. And then I'm going to do the bar cart and that will be the end of this little series. series. So yeah, y'all have a great one and we will see y'all on the next one. Enjoy the tour of the table, you guys. Friends anyway.